Now, North Korea's launch was timed to fall on one of America's biggest holidays of the year, Thanksgiving. U.S. media says the launch is the regime's message to Washington that the clock is ticking on leader Kim Jong-un's year-end deadline for the two sides to resume nuclear talks. Oh Siang with the details. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un sent a Thanksgiving message to U.S. President Donald Trump through his regime's latest missile launch, upping pressure on Washington to comply to Pyongyang's demands on denuclearization dialogue. That's the common perception among American media outlets as they reported on the North's latest firing of two projectiles. Reuters said the launch served as a reminder of the North's year-end deadline for the U.S. to come up with new approaches to restart their stalled denuclearization talks. It also noted the test firing came one day before the second anniversary of the North's ICBM test, a missile that reportedly has long enough range to hit the U.S. mainland. The launch is the latest in a series of provocations from the North this year, after the second summit between Trump and Kim broke down in Hanoi, as did working-level discussions in October to salvage the talks. Pyongyang has raised the stakes in recent weeks, rejecting President Trump's call to return to dialogue and slamming what it calls the U.S.'s hostile policy as well as its shortage of incentives to the North. The Washington Post says Thursday's test was an expression of the North's frustration over the Trump administration's refusal to grant its sanctions relief. The Trump administration provided its usual muted response to the launch. In line with its previous statements on North Korea's missile tests, the U.S. State Department said it's well aware of the launch and is monitoring the situation by consulting closely with its allies in the region. Oh Siang, Arirang News.